So on leaks leaked the Samsung Galaxy S21 or S30 and the Ultra version as well. And it looks very familiar. Yeah. That's my design, Samsung. I designed that. It's very curious that you happen to come up with the same idea when it looks so different. When it looks very different to a normal design that we usually see. Now, I didn't make a video of this, but I did tweet it out because I was conceptualizing the idea behind it. I needed to get the model right. And at the end, I failed to get it the way I really wanted to. For instance, the corner on mine on the side where you have the model itself. So you have the, the, the frame like that. You have then the corner right there, basically where the glass and the corner of the frame for the camera is touching. I couldn't get that in that round shape that I wanted it to be. So what happened is I said, yeah, can I get it the way I perfectly want it to be and make it look really proper the way I want it to be. So I kind of ditched the design itself. This was in, back in August. And now we got leaks of the Samsung Galaxy S21. It's bloody mine. Samsung, you got some explaining to do. <sighs> oh, mine would have featured the headphone jack though, by the way. Just saying. Yeah, so anyway, <laughs> S21 is leaked and we can see it in full glory. I'm going to leave a link in the description for, of course, unleaks. And it's mind boggling that... It looks so, so similar, even more so to what I've drawn out. Because on the drawing, I have a bit more freedom in what I want it to be like. So I had a chamfered edge idea, well, not chamfered in terms of it being glossy and whatnot, just like an edge to it. So it looked a bit more united. And that was the whole idea behind the design. The way I wanted to design this concept is basically have a flowing camera that flows with the frame itself instead of it being there just like, oop, bam. It's there, like a normal design is normally. So what I thought of, I'm going to make a design where you see that flowing into each other, where you see the flow of the frame to then, of course, the back camera. That's the main idea. Now, I was a little bit stuck on what I wanted to do with the buttons, though. That was the part that I was like, how am I going to do that part? The idea was to maybe have that with the camera. So this is why my camera unit looks quite large. Um, but I wasn't sure what I wanted to do and where I wanted to bring that design to. And, well, Samsung <laughs> kind of took that idea, like I said. I should have made a video of it. Ah, so lovely. So, uh, yeah, Samsung. You got some explaining to do, man. That's my design. Now, of course, all jokes aside, well... It's not really jokes because it really looks my design, especially like the drawing I made. I, I'm not sure how long it takes to make something like this really feasible. I think with the 3D model itself, I think they can do it in that amount of time where I published it. I published it in, in begin August, uh, 16th of August, I think it was, something around that time. I published this. And now Samsung has it online. It, well, Samsung didn't publish it. This is now from Onlyx, of course, so it isn't done. So it isn't a dumb model by any means, but it's definitely my design, at least in terms of looks. Now, did they really steal my idea? Well, I mean, it's possible. Um, I'm a concept creator. My art has been seen by Samsung and it has been seen by, for instance, Huawei as well. Uh, stuff like that. I know this because I heard from them themselves. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure how I should feel about it. If they really took that design idea from me, um, they could have asked. They could have given me credit if they are going to release it. Hit me up or something like that. With that, I feel like if they took it from me, just a regular concept creator, not the greatest concept creator out there to begin with, but just a regular concept creator that does this because he loves it, and then someone else takes that idea, especially a company like Samsung, I'd be pretty shitty if they didn't reach out and then say, hey, Jermaine, concept creator, dude, we saw that, what you made. We'd love for you to help us develop that design because mine wasn't developed yet. I had some integrations that I really wanted to make. It would have come out really similar to what you see with the leak from Unleaks. Uh, but yeah, if they just hit me up and all that, and if they took it from me, then, you know, I'll be fine. 
because I'm like, okay, I made this design and I sat there for days making this design because it's a design what I really wanted to get proper, especially first on drawing. I had like 10 or 12 designs that are thrown away with the same implementation of this. I just, I just wanted to get it right. And that was the struggle when I was designing this and I couldn't get it right just yet in 3D. So I skipped it and made a normal S21 design basically. Uh, yeah, so <laughs> that's my story on that one. We can see the S21 now and the S21 Ultra or the S30 or the S30 Ultra. Doesn't really matter. Either way, it's my design, Samsung. Oh, or none. <laughs> Either way, uh, yeah, stay tuned for more of my concepts here on my channel. Um, yeah, what do you think about the whole thing? Do you think it's mine? It looks really similar. Or do you think Samsung just happens to make the same design idea that is just kind of random? I doubt that one, but also I don't really feel like I should think, ah, a big ass company is taking what I'm designing. Either way, if they did, they could have at least contacted me. Either way, I hope you enjoyed this video. A little bit of a rant about Samsung Galaxy S21 or S30 and S30 Ultra or S21 Ultra. I don't know anymore what they're gonna name it. Anyway, have a good one and talk to you guys in the next.